Hello friends and fellow gamers, we're back on Angel Legion today and we're going to be doing some summons and then sending ourselves into simulated alpha to see if we could do more damage than we managed to do a few months ago. As well guys, this video is sponsored by Angel Legion, so if you want to check out this game you can find a link to download it below in the description and they're also giving away some more free stuff for your Angel Legion account. So if you're an Angel Legion player, be sure to click the link in the description that will take you to a code redeem page where you can enter your user ID and also the code FEB2021. That's right, it's FEB2021. And if you're curious how you can find your user code, if you go into your profile, you can find your user ID here. So there'll be the server number, at, and then your own special code. If you enter all that in, along with the code in the link below in the description, you'll get some free stuff for your Angel Legion account. Anyway, let's kick things off with our summons. We're going to be doing 100 summons today to hopefully try and get some heroes that can help us make a little bit of progress before we send ourselves in to simulated alpha. So let's start with the summons. Ghost Princess, nice. She's a healer that I'm currently not building, but copies of her are useful because I can use her to upgrade my Sakura Dancer because every copy of Ghost Princess can be fed with Sakura Dancer to make Sakura Dancer stronger. So that's really good to see. Let's try again. The sergeant, all right, we'll use her as food. Nothing there. So this is now 50 summons we've done, and there's a storm witch. Okay, let's do another 50. That's another copy of sergeant, okay. And for 70, we're not getting anything there. 80 is a copy of justice knight, that's nice. And for 90, nothing, and 100, again, nothing there all right but what we can do guys is we can go to the stardust shop and redeem two advanced sg boxes let's try and see what we can get anything good oh yes time guardian that copy of time guardian can be used with my phantom blade to make ss copies of phantom blade which is awesome but on the topic of SS heroes, I want to see if we can push Sakura Dancer up a little bit. Because she's a very important healer for my team. Keeps my heroes alive. So I want to see if we can upgrade her. So let's go to the Evolve menu. Let's feed in some heroes that we can comfortably use as food. Now Sergeant we can use as food, so let's do that. Let's Evolve her up. Nice! There's another star for Sakura Dancer. Let's go again. What more food do we have here? Shining Girl, absolutely. We'll put in the Sergeant once more. And another copy of Sergeant. Let's evolve. Sweet. All right, let's do it again with three more heroes. Okay, Battle Artist. Battle Artist. And one more. I think it's going to be this Shy Girl down here. We'll evolve her. And now you'll see we need... Oh, three more heroes. I was not expecting that. All right, so let's see... Ah, Punkatar... Punkatar and Punkatar. Easy. There we have it. Right. Now we need an SS copy of Sakura Dancer. So if we go to the cabin, we can do just that. We can grab an SS copy of Sakura Dancer. Let's also claim from the storage cabin whilst we're here. That would be a good idea. And let's go. Biological cabin. Let's go to advance and let's find one of our Sakura Dancers. You'll see that ghost princess we just got is placed in here. And now we need to add three more heroes. I'm going to go with Punkatar. I'm also going to go with one of these Dragon Knights. I've got six. I don't need all six. And let's go with a Storm Witch. Actually, you know what? I will keep the Dragon Knights. We'll just do two Storm Witches. That's fine. Let's advance. Yes, please. Let's promote an SS Sakura Dancer. Lovely. So that means now, if I go to my Sakura Dancer here, we can take her up to Silver. Very nice. Now that also means we can adjust her talents. So we have 12 talent points. Now I've started in Overlord to make her silent resist, which is important when facing enemies. But I want to see if I can improve maybe her crit or her attack so that her healing is more potent. Now where do I put her in my team? I put her on the back line and the maybe partner's what I need to look for. Crit resistance, crit resistance, what's this giving? Crit. Crit resistance. So it's all about crit resist. Well, she's not really going on the front line, so I don't need that crit resist. So I think Overlord is actually the way to go. Now, you can't dodge a heal, so hit is not useful on her. So really, I think we just want to up her crit. So let's learn this. If the hero is not affected by an artifact bonus, increase their crit by 15%. Absolutely, let's give her that. And that's her taken up. 
In fact, I believe if we save this and confirm, we can also go and upgrade, I think, Deadly Shadow. Oh, that's right. I haven't evolved Deadly Shadow up because I don't have the hero to make her SS. Or at least I don't think I do. Let's go in the cabin and have a check. So to SS Deadly Shadow, yeah, that's right. I don't have Flame Witch. Man, I've been trying and trying and just cannot get a copy. Maybe I can get one soon in the future. But it seems that my recruits today didn't grant me one and neither did the boxes I opened using Stardust. Well, before all is lost, let's go see if there's anything for sale in the sales section. Nope, no fancy heroes available. So in that case, guys, we are going to send ourselves in to the simulated alpha with our upgraded team. Also, should we upgrade the level of Sakura Dancer? Nah, I think with the crit, she should be able to heal okay. Those extra things are nice. What I will do, though, is I will see how much further can we take Phantom Blade. She's currently level 250. Can we get her to 260? That'd be nice. Yes, we can. And that is actually her max level. Perfect. So we've got a max level Phantom Blade for what her star level is currently. The same can be said for Deadly Shadow. The others are still lagging behind, but we sadly don't have the resources to follow suit. So in that case, guys, let's go to the simulated alpha. Now, if you don't know how the simulated alpha works, it's very simple. There is a leaderboard containing the people who have achieved. There is a leaderboard containing a list of people who have achieved the most damage. Currently, Zack and Rash hold the top spots, but I think with my Phantom Blade, we might just be able to beat this. The highest damage we've ever managed was 11 million so far. I think we can easily beat that, in fact. Yeah, that's destroyable. Let's see what the current things are saying for the all-server ranking. How much damage do you need to do to get onto the all-server leaderboard? Let's see. Okay, scrolling down. 21 million. That's interesting. Let's make that our target. 21 million damage. Let's see if it's doable. We're going to bring Ares. We've got Sakura Dancer, Mysterious Girl, Deadly Shadow, Magic Arrow, Phantom Blade, and Storm Witch. Let's fight. Okay. So, when we've done this before in the past, we've had a little bit of problem trying to keep our energy up. But now that our Magic Arrow is SS, it's much easier. It's still all about energy conservation. So, let's go with basic attacks on Sakura Dancer and only heal when we need to. And we'll go with basic attacks on most other people so that Phantom Blade can use her attack to follow up. But with Maya, we will use an active skill because it will boost everybody else up. Okay, let's go with an active skill from Deadly Shadow because she should crit. Yes, she did. Active skill from Magic Arrow because she is just going to pump energy in. And then basic attack with Phantom Blade to increase her energy so she does more damage. And then basics with Storm Witch. And hopefully Phantom Blade will join in. Very nice. Okay, same thing again. Basic attack from Sakura. Attacks following through there. Let's see if anyone can help trigger Phantom Blade. It's not looking like it. But maybe we can get lucky. Okay, Storm Witch, work well for me. Hey, nice crit there from Phantom Blade. Beautiful. Alright, let's go with a basic. And basic again. And... Deadly Shadow, I think we can active skill here, just because she currently does more damage than Phantom Blade. But from now on, I am going to basic attack as Phantom Blade's energy is getting higher and higher. One thing I will do here with Magic Arrow is I think I am just going to active skill, maybe? Yeah, I will active skill with Magic Arrow. I can't afford not to. Just got to keep that energy coming into Sakura Dancer. And we'll go with a basic again from Phantom Blade. Let's keep it ticking on over. All right, we're on 2.2 million right now. Very nice. Now, some people will be tempted to attack with Ares as he's ready to go, but I'm not going to because Ares' attack won't do as much damage because if you see here, there is defense on this simulated alpha, so we're going to skip. Instead, I'm going to use an active heal from Sakura Dancer. You can see this debuff a bunch all our heroes' names. That means they're going to do less attack, so hopefully Sakura Dancer, with her Purify ability, will remove it. There you go, it's gone, and we are healed up. Lovely. In that case, we are going to basic with Maya. And, okay, look, Deadly Shadow's health isn't too hot right now, so we'll use a UAV to heal her up. Very nice. Magic Arrow is actually looking great, so I will use her active skill. Phantom Blade, funnily enough, is looking good for health as well, so I will use her basic attack. And Storm Witch is looking alright too, so let's go. 
Okay, so Corridancer's energy is currently 19, so I think we can get away with using an active skill from Sakuradancer, which will give us a bunch of healing. Let's do it. Look at that. Nice. Now, we're going to go active skill with Maya, buffing everybody's attack. And now, Deadly Shadow with the basic. Phantom Blade not joining in, unfortunately. Active from Magic Arrow, feeding energy to herself and Sakuradancer. And here's another basic from Phantom Blade. Now, critting for 400,000. Wow. Come on, Stormwitch. Don't let me down. Big damage. Okay, it's going well. Nice. Okay. Here we go. Another active heal from Sakura Dancer. Keeping us alive. Basics from everybody else. Come on, Stormwitch. Oh, no. She didn't attack multiple times. That is sad. Okay, we are going to need a lot of healing here from Sakura Dancer. And also, she needs to remove that debuff. She did. Excellent. Alright, basics please from everyone else. Nice. Come on, Phantom Blade, join in. She didn't. Active from Magic Arrow. And as you can see, Phantom Blade's health isn't looking fantastic. So I am going to use a UAV just to proc her up a little bit. And hopefully she'll join in with Stormwitch here. Just for that little bit of damage. Alright, no, didn't go that well. But instead, we'll just send in Ares and continue as normal. Here goes. Whack. Okay. Heal from Sakura Dancer. Very good. And we're going to go with Maya's active skill to buff everybody. And then basics all round. Phantom Blade. Big damage, please. Ooh, not quite critting. Let's carry on, though. Can we get lucky? Not quite. Good dodge there, though, from Phantom Blade. Heal again from Sakura Dancer. Very good. Come on, Phantom Blade. Join in. Oh, she's not joining in, which is very sad. Because that's the main way this team's going to be doing damage. Oh, wow! A whole round of basics and she didn't join in at all? Come on, Phantom Blade. Letting the side down. Let's at least try and get some damage here. I know... We're not doing as much damage as we'd like, because she does have that defensive bubble up. But we're trying. Okay, sending in Ares again for another smack. It's not going to deal much. And here comes Sakura Dancer with the heal. Very nice. And Maya buffing the team. Very good. All right, basics all around. Come on. Oh, Phantom Blade, join in. Just there we go. Phantom Blade with a big fat crit. Oh, there you go. She just did a million damage in little quick succession. Come on, carry on. Keep doing it. Yeah, let's go. That was a good round. That was a nice juicy amount of damage. Okay, Sakura Dancer, heal the team. Let's get it in. Basics all round again. Let's see if Phantom Blade's gonna play ball this time. Oh, no, she's not now. Come on. Alright, maybe we can do a big crit. Ah, oh, unfortunately not. Okay. Whoa! Phantom Blade's health is super low. Sakura Dancer... Let's get those heals in, please. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. And, alrighty. We are going to go with some basics just from people that have a lot of health. If they don't have a lot of health, we're going to UAV. It is that simple. Giving energy to Magic Arrow there. UAVing Phantom Blade because her health is atrocious. And Stormwitch maybe getting a few little one-to-ones with Phantom Blade here. Unfortunately not. Alright. In comes Aerie once, once more. Come on, Aries. Nice. Heal from Sakura. Okay, it's working out just. Maya with the buff. Alright, Deadly Shadow. Let's get some basics across the board. Okay, maybe not. Phantom Blade. Where's the big hit? Good, big money. Nice. Okay, good dodge, Phantom Blade. Just when we needed it. Excellent. Getting our health back into the green. That's what we want. Alright, energy from Magic Arrow. Come on. Phantom Blade with the basic. Oh, not critting again, but that's fine. Come on. Some good tandems between her and Stormwitch, please. Alright, we're on 10 million. Not the highest, unfortunately. But it's more than we've, I think, managed in the past. I think we managed 14 million at one point. Hmm. Bit irritating, but hey. Come on, Maya. Let's look. We're on round 16. Come on, let's get that basic. Maybe Phantom Blade will join in, if we're lucky. Yeah, there we go. Now she's playing ball. 
Alrighty, let's go with a UAV. Very nice. And Stormwitch. Let's go. Okay, Sakura, I'm just going to do a basic with right now. And then we're going to active heal following up on the other attacks. Just because we're a little behind on energy right now. Okay, Maya's going to send in an active skill to buff everyone. And basics again. Active from Magic Arrow, give another energy. Let's do this. Come on, Storm Witch. Let's get some good hits from Phantom Blade. Oh, not quite. Not playing as well as they could have done. That's a shame. Ooh, Phantom Blade's health is looking very low. That's not good. No, no, no. Uh-oh. We may have to start this one again. Yikes. I'm scared Phantom Blade's gonna die here. I think she is. Yep. We made one blunder in this run where we accidentally did a basic with Magic Arrow instead of an active. And it cost us. Alright, I am gonna... Should we see this out? Yeah, let's see it out. Let's see how far we can go. Maybe we can get a good score under our belts. That's fine. But unfortunately, we didn't quite make it to dealing as much damage as we'd have liked. We can still get a lot of damage out here, though, which is nice. But just not doing as well as we could have done. Right, again, sending in Ares for the final push. Here it is. Round 20. Another big heal from Sakura. And everybody else just attacking as they can. And there it is. That is our damage. 13 million. We managed to get 7th place on this leaderboard. Interesting. Let's just see what Zack's team is right now. If he's getting 57 million, I'm really curious. Maybe he's got a really strong Phantom Blade at the moment. I will have to see. Let's go see what he's running. Oh, wow. That'll be why she is red starred. That is crazy. With max martial gear as well. That is enviable. Holy moly. Is there any way I can get this? I think I might be able to, actually. I think we can upgrade her. So if I go to the mall and I go... Do I want to go to the military match? No, 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 no. Let's think about this. Let's use our brains. Yellow crystals. If I cash them in for a copy of Time Guardian, we'll be able to push Phantom Blade, potentially. Let's see. So I need two SS copies of Phantom Blade to get her to Gold Star. Alright. I have the two chests in my storage right now, which are Phantom Blade copies potentially, because they're Katana heroes. Ooh, I wonder. You know what? I'm going to open these. Let's see what we get from this. Okay. We're getting some decent heroes, some less good heroes, but we do need the food, so food is fine. And whilst we're here, I'll open my fashion shards, because I know some of you are probably itching to see what we get. Mm, ooh. Secret scout. Cool. That looks snazzy. Alright. Now, let's go back to our heroes. And let's think about this. So, how many copies do we have? Let's... Actually, it'll tell us here. Yes, great! That's the menu I was looking for. So, we have... One copy of Time Guardian. No copies of Phantom Blade. So we need one more copy of Time Guardian. Yeah, so I can pull one out using the yellow crystals. Easy. So yeah, if we grab this, confirm. There's our Time Guardian. Now if we go to these chests and use them to get Phantom Blade. There she is. Claim. And get another Phantom Blade. Oh, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Biological Cabin. Advance. And where is she? There she is. Phantom Blade. And we're going to pop in Sergeant. We're going to pop in Punkatar. And we'll go with the Storm Witch. Advance. Confirm. Very nice. And we will do it one more time. Same thing. Phantom Blade with the Time Guardian. And we're going to put in Dragon Knight. And we're going to put in... Who is food for me? Shy Girl. Yes. 
And you know what? Another copy of Dragon Knight. We have four others remaining after this. We get them very easily. There we go. Awesome. So, with those two Phantom Blade copies, we'll go. Two Phantom Blade and Evolver. Awaken. Look at that. One star. Now. What? I need another SS copy to push her forward? Oh, man. This is so hard. Getting copies of heroes is so difficult. Yikes. It's all part of the grind, though. All part of the fun. And we have 12 talent points remaining. Okay, so what have we gone for here? Crit. Increase its own resistance when the three heroes are affected by the uh, enemy skill. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because we kind of had to pick between one of those. And resistance is better because I don't want to take negative effects. Then there's crit. Now, what's this? Fight together. Each adjacent hero increases its crit by 12%. Or each adjacent hero increases its dodge. Okie dokie. I think we're going to go with crit. Maybe. I have four syringes, so I can replace this if I want to change my mind. But for now, I think we do go with crit and I press save. Oh, but is crit going to help? It can help. Potentially. Potentially, we can put Sakura Dancer next to her and just give her tons of stuff in PvP. Yeah, that's fine. Dodge is nice, though. But she's not going to go on the front line, so I think it's crit for now. Or is it dodge? It's crit. It's crit. Yeah. Oh, it increases her own crit? Oh! Well, in that case, yeah, that's fine. All right. Let's send ourselves in, then. If that's going to boost her crit... That was a no-brainer. So let's try one more time, my friends. Simulated Alpha. Here goes. So, kicking things off as usual with a basic from Sakura Dancer. Maya buffing the team. And we'll go with an active skill from Deadly Shadow. Critting for a decent chunk. Magic Arrow, Smacking, and Phantom Blade. How much damage can you do? Oh, that was juicy. For an early crit, that was really fat. Oh, now she's critting way more often too? <laughs> oh, I'm happy. I am very happy with this. Lovely. Let's get those crits out. In that case, let's go with a beautiful, beautiful active skill from Magic Arrow. Just buffing up Sakura Dancer. And just basics from Phantom Blade. Whoa, she is hitting like a machine now. This is crazy. I'm glad we're doing this. All right, let's carry on then. More basics. And then just basic attacks across the board. Yeah, I think we even have to basic with Deadly Shadow here just in case Phantom Blade joins in. Hell yeah. Active skill from Magic Arrow. Phantom Blade with the basic. Hitting for a decent amount. Can she sa- Not synergizing with Storm Witch there. That's a shame. But here comes Sakura Dancer with a juicy heal. Getting that Purify, removing the debuff, and everybody else just follows suit. Let's just hit, and hit, and hit. Let's deal as much damage as we can. Let's take her down. Here goes Ares, in with the attack. Nice. Okay, here's an active skill from Sakura, giving everyone a little bit of health. Lovely jubbly. Maya buffing the team. Deadly Shadow with a basic. Hoping Phantom Blade joins in. She does not. Alright, Phantom Blade with the basic. <sighs> Critting for nearly half a million. And it's only going to get higher as her energy increases. Wow, I've got a good feeling about this. A really good feeling about this. We are going to basic with Sakura. And then we're going to basic from everybody else as well. I am not liking Deadly Shadow's health. But I think she can survive... I'm tempted to leave it, though. I think she'll be okay. Yeah, a little bit of healing there. That's good. Sakura Dancer's thing doing its thing. She does a little passive heal on their turn, which is nice. Come on, Phantom Blade. Hit like a truck. Oh, yes, she does. Man, the fact her crit has gone way up has just massively increased her damage numbers. We're on 6 million, and we're on round 7. This is crazy. Right, let's remove the debuff. Oh! We didn't purify? Okay, good thing we've got another active skill from Sakura Dancer next turn to make up for this 1 in 10 chance where that doesn't happen. Alright, we're going to basic them with Maya. We are definitely UAVing on this Deadly Shadow because her health is low. We will active with Magic Arrow just to feed in that energy. We will UAV with Phantom Blade because her health is low. And come on, Storm Witch. 
Let's just maybe get a few hits in. Every bit of damage helps. Okay, here comes Ares. Can we get a big smack? Yes, we can. All right. Here comes a Purify! Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Active skill from Maya. Buffing, let's see. Basics across the board. Oh, a Phantom Blade. 600,000 damage in a single hit. Now we're talking. Okay. Phantom Blade, don't let me down. Another crit. So good. Can she do something like that with Storm Witch as well? Yes, she can! <laughs> Woo! Four heroes dodged then. That was nice. All right, Sakura Dancer with some GC heals as well. Oh, this is going very, very, very well. Much better than our first run, for sure. Oh, lovely. Okay, Phantom Blade. Yeah! And Storm Witch! A little bit of damage coming in there too. We're on 11 million already. And we're not even halfway through. Okay, Sakura, we really need you to get some good heals off now. Because a lot of our heroes are looking pretty squishy. A lot of the health pools are looking low. And low is not good. I'm even going to UAV on Phantom Blade just to get her health up. Storm Witch with some basics. Maybe Phantom Blade wants to join in. Unfortunately not. All right, Ares, smack him. Kathwak. And come on, Sakura Dancer, heal yourself up. Your health's looking scarily low. Maya gonna buff the team. Basics from everyone else, apart from an active here from Magic Arrow. Oh, whoa, nearly half a million, and she didn't even crit. Man, Phantom Blade is absolutely popping off right now. Sadly, not joining in with Storm Witch there, though. That's a shame. Sakura Dancer. Oh, she crit! That's what we wanted. Massive heal there. Beautiful. That has taken all my worries away. I've got a very good feeling about the amount of damage we're going to do now. Okay, Magic Arrow. Just keep giving that energy to Sakura. Phantom Blade. <sighs> Lovely crit. Do some stuff with Storm Witch here. Let's go. And again. Yes! Oh, two hits back to back. Beautiful. I love that combo. It is so, so good. Alrighty, Maya. Should we go with a buff from you or a basic? I think a basic. We're on that awkward round right now. Yeah, basics across the board, I think. Oh, wow. Now Phantom Blade decides to join in. Ridiculous. When the enemy has defenses, Phantom Blade attacks. Crazy. Alrighty. Here comes Storm Witch. Alright, it's looking good at the moment. I'm enjoying this. Okay, Ares. Hit him hard. And again, Sakura just keeping those heals up. That's what we like. Maya buffing the team. Basic from Deadly Shadow. And guys, you know the drill. Energy from Magic Arrow. Just keep that damage coming in. It is beautifully high. Let's see if we can get some more Storm Witch Phantom Blade action. Not quite. Alright, big heal please. She didn't crit, but that's fine. Our health is still above critical. So this is fine. Oh, wow, we're on 17 million damage now. This is madness. Oh, we might even get to 18 million pretty soon. All right, Sakura Dancer, get a Purify for me. There it is. Nice. Basic from Maya. And I'm going to UAV Deadly Shadow. Her health is looking quite low. Obviously an active from Magic Arrow here, keeping that coming in. And a UAV from Phantom Blade. And then, of course, Storm Witch with some basics. I say some, she only got one, but hey, that's that. Come on, Ares. <sighs> Setting up some good damage there. And Maya going to buff the team. Here we go. Nice. Alrighty. We're approaching the end. Do you think we can break 20 million? Do you think we can break 21 million? Oh, man. Let's go. think we can oh yes all right active skill here from sakura dancer here comes the basic from maya maybe phantom blade joins in okay clearly not oh there she's joining in now though that's good all right i've got a great feeling here i think we're gonna break the leaderboards let's see it because we're on 21 million we've still got a few rounds left sakura dancer with a big juicy heal for the team 
pretty please. We didn't get the purify. Ooh, right. Okay, round 19. I will active with Maya to give us two rounds of our buff. I will basic with Deadly Shadow just in case something happens. Okay, that's 45,000 damage. That's, eh, it's acceptable. Okay. Hmm. I think we basic with Magic Arrow right now. No, we feed a little bit of energy to Sakura Dancer because we can. It might not... No, I don't think that was the right decision. Oh, well. It's only lost us a tiny amount of damage. It's negligible. We have to UAV here with Phantom Blade because I can't risk her dying. And here comes Stormwitch. Alright. Sakura Dancer, we need that Purify now. To break 21 million, we need Purify. So here it comes. There it is! Now, basics all round. Phantom Blade, please join in. Oh, she didn't join in there. Come on. Please, Phantom Blade. There it is. We've hit 22 million. Can we get to 23 mil? I'm going to go with a basic on Magic Arrow. Phantom Blade joins in. Phantom Blade again. That's 23 million. Can we get to 24 million? Storm Witch. Let's see. No. And there it is. 23 million. Oh, man. Wow. And just like that, thanks to that 23 million damage, we are now third on the server leaderboard with Rash just above us and Zack at the top there. And guys, if you go and look at the all server ranking, I am rank 47th in the world. Just because of that little change we made to our Phantom Blade. We're using the beautiful synergy between Storm Witch and Phantom Blade. It's great. We're dealing a ton of damage. This is a fantastic team. And I cannot wait to see where we go with this in the future. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. If you've enjoyed this, make sure to hit that like button. And why not, if you haven't already, check out Angel Legion by using the Google link down below in the description. And of course, don't forget to redeem Feb 2021 to get your free rewards for your Angel Legion account. Until next time, happy idling.